Ladies and gentlemen, I just woke up not too long ago. Uh, we are out here still drinking our coffee, but Konami decided to drop some brand new, possibly tier one, Bright Fleet Dragons. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's your host with the most, Avery LR32 here, destroying the ever-living boo-boo state and off that like and subscribe button as we climb even higher, the 1300 ladder. Let's just jump on into it here. So, these are meant to be like Mahjong tiles or whatever, but we're going with the name Bestowed Dragon. These come out of, uh, I believe, Legacy of Destruction. Uh, yeah, I think that's what the, the card is on here. I think this is Legacy of Destruction. So this is the set after Phantom Nightmare. So don't worry, we're not getting these for a while. So the first card we have is Bestowed Dragon Pydra, level 3 Fire Dragon Effect Monster, 1700 attack, 1000 offense. You can only use the first effect of this card's name once per turn. If this card's normal or special summon, you can take a Bright Fleet Spell or Trap from your deck and add it to your hand or set it. You take no battle damage from battles involving your Fire Dragon Monsters. Once per turn during the battle phase, you can Quick Effect immediately after this effect resolves Secret Summon using this card to control. I already read these cards before I started making this video, but I think it's interesting that the majority of the effect monsters all have the effect that during the battle phase you can synchro summon. So you can kind of set up your board in the main phase, you know, maybe try to out things like an IP Masquerade or use talents to take something, and then you can just go into the battle phase and start doing a bunch of synchro summons. Next up here we have Bestow Dragon Fadra, level 3 Fire Dragon Effect Monster, 1600 attack, 1000 offense. You can only use the first effect of this card's name once per turn. If this card's no more special summon or at the start of the damage step, if a monster battles, you can target one level 4 lower Fire Dragon Monster in your graveyard, special summon it. Your Fire Dragon Monsters cannot be destroyed by battle. Once per turn during the battle phase, you can quick effect immediately after this effect resolves. Synchro summon using this card to control. Keep in mind that these monsters say during the battle phase, so it's either player's battle phase. So you can just leave one of these up on the board just to be able to have a synchro summon during uh, the opponent's battle phase. Um, but the fact that this says normal or special summon or at the start of the damage step if a monster battles, then you can just summon back a fire dragon monster. Um, and all of these are level 4 or lower. So, yeah. Um, the only thing that makes me worried is like, this isn't a tuner. This isn't a tuner. I'm pretty sure that there's a tuner among these somewhere. Yeah, here's the tuner, as I just said that. Uh, <laughs> Bestowed Dragon Chun Chundra? Chunkamunk? Whatever. Level 4 Dragon Tuner. Fire Effect Monster. 1500 Attack. 1000 Defense. You can only use the first and second effect of this card's name each once per turn. I'm sorry if I sound terrible, you guys. I just woke up. Like I said, I, I had RSV. We're, we're still trying to get better. If you control a Fire Dragon Monster, you could special summon this card from your hand. That's hot. At the start, oh, because they're fires. I just realized that's a pun. Sorry. <laughs> At the start of the damage step, if a monster battles, you can special summon a level four lower fire dragon monster from your deck except itself. Once per turn during the battle phase, you can quick effect, blah, 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 sick or something using, using this card to control. So this is the tuner. That's uh, that's pretty cute. This here is uh, Bright Fleet Rise Dragon Biden Dragion. Yeah, notice that there's an I there, so it's not dragon. Uh, fire Dragon Synchro Tuner Effect Monster, level 7, 2600 attack, 2000 offense. One Dragon Tuner plus one more non tuner Dragon Monster. The level 7 is um, not a bad level for this archetype. You can only use the first effect of this card's name once per turn. You can only use the second effect once per duel. So the first effect is that if this card Synchro Summon, you can target a Fire Dragon Monster in your graveyard to special summon it. Also, you cannot special summon monsters for the rest of this turn except Dragon Monsters. Second effect, again, is once per duel. If three or more attacks have been declared this turn, Quick effect, you get special summon this card from your graveyard, then pop a spell or trap on the field. That does not target. Very interesting. Now, there is also the synchro monster we have called Trident Dragion that's very old. I don't know what that card's effect is off the top of my head. I would imagine that you would play that in this deck because I think it's like a level 10 synchro, so keep that in mind. Also, uh, Blaster is about to go through the roof in price tag uh, because all these cards are fire. Bright Fleet Super Dragon Transcend Dragion. Try saying that 10 times fast. Level 10 Fire Dragon Synchro Effect Monster, 3,000 attack and defense. That artwork is sexy. One Dragon Tuner plus one or more non-tuner Dragon Monsters. You can only use the third effect of this card's name once per duel. If this card's Synchro Summon, you can change all monsters on the field to attack mode. All monsters must attack if able. Also, your opponent cannot activate cards or effects during the battle phase. It's kind of whatever. If three or more attacks have been declared this turn, quick effect, you could special summon this card from your graveyard, then you could pop a card on the field. The only thing that makes me worried about this type of card is the fact that, like, Battle phase shenanigans aren't always the best. Like, if you're synchro summoning during the battle phase, that's cool. But, like, not being able to activate cards or effects, I guess. But, I, I don't know. Uh, this field spell is disgusting, though. You can only use the second effect of this card's name once per turn. Fire dragon monsters you control are unaffected by your opponent's activated effects 
during your main phase one. That means you can't hand trap these things. You can't Valor, you can't Imperm, uh, you, you can't do anything like that. You can't Ash Blossom like the, the Searcher. Like, that's that's insane. During your main phase, you can have one bestowed dragon monster from your deck to your hand, then ditch a card. That's fine. If this card is destroyed during the battle phase, okay, you can target a dragon synchro monster, you control its tap becomes doubled. I guess that's why they made it during the battle phase, because then you just get absolutely punished. Um, but during the battle phase just seems really specific. Also, I know I say it every video, why do you organization? you got to fix your issues with ads. Next up here, we have Bright Fleet Opening, Quick Play Spell. You can only activate one card with this card's name per turn. If this card was activated, and this is a first for a card, if this card was activated outside the battle phase, so I guess I have to go outside the venue or outside the card shop and go stand outside in the rain or whatever and play this card. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But outside the battle phase, so any phase that is not called the battle phase, apply one of these effects. If it was activated during the battle phase, you can apply any of them in sequence. <laughs> Add one level 4 or lower fire dragon monster from your deck to your hand. Special summon one fire dragon monster from your hand. Um, so if you can apply them in sequence, you can literally just add a level 4 lower and instantly summon it. You can summon any of the effect monsters because they let you fucking synchro summon. And like you can just pop off in the battle phase. So I don't know if this is the entire wave of support. Pretty sure it's out of Legacy of Destruction, like I said. Um, but I think these cards are pretty good. People, of course, are going to clickbait and say, oh, tier one dragons, blah, 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 blah. It's too early for that, Sugar Boo Bear. Um, I don't know. They definitely seem good at a glance, um, but only time will tell. Yeah, is going to have to put up a combo video or some shit and be like, oh, look, we can play through all these things. And then before you know it, it's like Raid Raptor where it's still garbage. Yeah, we, I tried testing with that. The Raid Raptors are still horrible. Guys, let me know what you guys think. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.